Yo, what's going on guys, Professor here, back again with another video. In this video guys, I'm going to be playing a best of 5 match against uh, Professor Live, one of the best Ejon players in the world, and if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like and sub, and I'll see you guys in the first match. Okay, let's go, first match, and on the first game here, I'm playing Minor Match Gorsha deck guys, I'm playing Minor Match Gorsha Tornado deck, uh, without a knight or valkyrie so it's basically fast cycle minor magic washer wallbreaker cycle deck and also guys if you guys don't know professor live he is one of the best djn players as i said and also he also has a youtube channel which is right here guys and if you guys want to you guys can subscribe to him and also watch his content he also uploads really good content if you guys are djn player i highly recommend you guys to watch his content so i guess on the first game he's playing expo he's playing ice bow i guess uh not the best matchup for us to be honest because um we don't have a knight or valkyrie and expo is a really bad matchup if you don't have a knight or valk in this deck so what's gonna be a really difficult matchup for me ah uh, okay okay hmm he wasted the log i'm gonna go spirit goblins and then i'm gonna go Okay, if you played skeletons, I would have played my uh, warbreakers, but I have to play them on top of that e -wiz. Bro, how did that e connect connected to the tower so fast? Anyway, so good NATO it is in. I'm going to go for my miner here. I'm pretty sure he's going to go knight so you can catch it anyway. Or evil skeletons, so that's also fine. I'm going to go marcher here because I don't have much of a choice. I have to get damage. And I know that I'm going to be down elixir, but I have to do it. Hmm, he's gonna go expo, I'm gonna go prediction bomb tower, I mean prediction bomb tower for the expo, yeah. Pretty good bomb tower prediction, but that's gonna be not gonna be enough, the expo is gonna still... The expo did not connect, but the evil knight and um, ice Wiz is a really big threat. Yeah, really nice nato at his end. I guess, yeah, that's game over. <laughs> Bruh, what a... What a really great way to start a video. Um, I guess I'm going to let the knight go. Get a hit. And then I'm going to play my miner. And then I'm going to go magic archer. Mm, yeah, I'm going to go magic archer now. Skeletons. Okay, we got the Tesla though. But yeah, that does not matter too much. We're not going to get connection from the magic archer. Like, we're not going to get lineup. The expo is healthy. And it's going to connect to the tower. And that's game. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much game over, guys. So, I guess I'll see you guys in the next game. Okay, starting off the game number two. And the deck number two, guys, I am running this uh, Pix EQ Cycle deck. With the yeah, Pix EQ Cycle deck with the Evil Bomber. And as you guys know, Evil Bomber is way too broken. So, this deck is also really good. Like, it's also a really good Evil Bomber deck to abuse the Evil Bomber, basically. So, yeah, let's go for a win. I guess he's running Minor Match Gorcher. Yep, he's running Minor Match Gorcher deck. So, but is he running Knights or Valkyrie or none of them? Oh, nice, we got two bomb to Bomber connection, that's nice. And yeah, he's saying oops because that connected to the tower for two hits. So, I guess I'm going to go Skeleton like this for the Miner, maybe, if he plays it. Mm, okay. Um, I guess I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go Bomber on top of that Valkyrie. I'm going to go Bomber. Hopefully, we get a hit. Ah, oh, really nice Miner prediction, though, I didn't. I was not expecting that Miner, though. But yeah, really nice prediction. going to go Delivery for the Warbreakers. And really bad Marcher, I didn't. That's not going to line up. And not the best log as well. I'm gonna pop the ability here. And then I'm gonna go for my evil skeleton because uh, is he back to Valkyrie? Ah he is. I thought he's not back to Valk, but yeah, if he, if he was not back to Valk, I would have went for my evil skeletons, but it's still fine. I'm gonna split them with my piggies. So he went bomb tower. Uh skeletons. Ah, one of them almost stayed alive and he also missed the nade. Like he didn't need that nade though. But yeah, it's fine. So okay, I guess I'm gonna go for my bomber at the back to cycle back to the evil farm. 
and i'm also up some nice damage though that's that's quite good i guess i'm gonna go low versus the bridge predict the merger really nice prediction i'm gonna pop the ability as well just in case if he goes for the nado or something i'm gonna earthquake those spirit goblins yeah why not the low prince was on the tower for two shots which is great and then i'll go for my pigs again at the bridge is he's back to bomb tower yeah now he is because he cycled the magic orchard in the back uh okay i guess i'm gonna cycle earthquake on the tower and then i'm gonna go for my canyon delivery log for the marcher oh no the delivery did not hit it but hopefully he does not nado it okay thank you if he nado that delivery would have got like a lot of damage but it's fine gonna skeleton like this oh really aggressive nado it is in bro the more magic or just hitting my other tower what and i missed the and i missed the earthquake and the log but at least we got some piggies damage that's what matters so i guess i'm gonna go for my bomber at the back cycle back to the evil form and then low prince skeletons split piggies also split prediction not prediction like just earthquake and nice we got some more damage out of that piggies which is great hmm i guess i'm gonna go for my delivery for the magic orchard and then okay magic orchard hit my tower once it's fine i'm gonna go earthquake like this and then uh, i guess delivery and then log the magic orchard so it does not line up to my delivery guy gonna go for the piggies i'm gonna be ready with my bomb with my evil bomber just in case if he goes like a magic archer <laughs> like a valkyrie or something uh, i'm gonna earthquake that cycle earthquake to get some damage i'm gonna deliver the marcher log it as well oh really nice log delivery but i still have to play my can and i was not sure about that uh one one wall breaker gonna log gonna uh, not log earthquake he's gonna log hmm okay i'm kind of scared though even though i'm up a lot of damage right now but i'm still kind of scared not gonna lie gonna cannon like this pop the ability okay perfect ability though gonna log over here hopefully he's gonna go marcher for sure so i'm gonna go for my piggies this way he's gonna be low on elixir and i'm gonna go earthquake and yep we got some nice piggies damage that's great and that should be pretty much game over so i'll just go cannon like this high up low prince pop the ability and that's gonna be gg so really nice win and i'll see you guys in the next match okay let's go game number three on the next deck here, guys, I'm running Draw, Draw, Evil Firecracker, Evil Night Tornado deck, and yeah, let's see what is he running. And also, guys, I guess I started, I said at the start of the video that this is um a best of five match. Like basically, we're gonna play five games, and anyone who wins three of the game, three games, is gonna win. So right now we are one one. Uh, I lost game number one. But then a lot, but then I won game number two, so this is game number three. Uh, I guess he's running Expo, yeah, he's running Expo. Mm, not the best matchup for me, not gonna lie. Uh, but I'll still try to, I'll still try to, to win it. I'm gonna go Firecracker like this to snipe those archers, and then, hmm, gonna go Drill here. Night for that X uh, Expo for some reason Expo hit my firecracker which I don't know why but it's fine I'm gonna lock uh oh no I have to play my evil firecracker as well otherwise it's gonna take a lot of damage mm, it's fine though it's so fine so is he gonna activate the king okay he did damage it's fine uh okay hmm it's kind of weird for me that why is he not running a knight in the deck and he's running an ice golem. So I'll, I have to go draw on top of the expo. Kind of, it's kind of weird, but I have to. I'm going to go log as well because he's back to evolution skeletons, but we missed them. Uh, oh no. Okay, I have to go with my firecracker. 
you can activate the king this time for sure though hmm okay got the king to activation there so i have no idea how am i supposed to defend the expos like i just go knight and then what then nothing <laughs> So yeah, that's the only thing that I just have no idea how to defend. Hmm. Okay, I have to go Firecracker. Oh no, that was really good, Ice Spirit. Oh no, I'm gonna go Knights for the other Expo. I have to let the Expo at the left hand lane go. I'm gonna go Drew. Lock for the Skeletons or something. Hmm. Okay, Firecracker. Evil Firecracker is gonna hit the tower, which is quite good for us, though, not gonna lie. Yeah, that's some nice damage for us. So I'll just go for my Evil Knight for the other Expo, and then draw to pressure him. So I'm gonna go Goblins, Firecracker for the Archers. Uh, okay, hmm. We're still good, though. We're still good, though. But, alright, I'm gonna go Knight, I'm gonna go Draw again on his tower. And then, I have no idea what to do, I'm gonna go Log, Goblins, Firecracker, oh no, if that Firecracker stayed alive, that would have been so good for us, but, yeah, it's, it's still not game over though, it's still not game over, I'm gonna go Bomb Tower, hopefully it is not Tesla, okay, that's nice gonna go firecracker like this ice spirit uh oh no the expo's on the tower please stop hitting my tower wait log is out of hands so i'm gonna go like this goblins and then knight at the bridge for the expo mm, okay i'm gonna go firecracker at the bridge hopefully he does not go anything oh no he played tesla bro how did he know <laughs> like how was he so fast with it how was his brain like Thinking that like, I'm gonna go firecracker in that position <laughs> because I didn't play firecracker at all at the bridge in this matchup. So I'm gonna go another draw. Oh no, gonna go knight, evil firecracker at the bridge at the opposite lane, log the expo. And okay, I'm gonna go bomb tower. And then I'm going to play my drill. Oh, no. Wait, he missed the fireball. That's kind of good. Going to go for my knight here. Lock. Nado. Oh, no. Really late Nado at my end. Going to go ice spirits. Drill. Goblins. And then log. And then I have to play my knight. No, the expo connected. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> GG's I guess, so I'll see you guys in the next match. Alright, let's go, game number 4, and in the deck guys, I'm playing Drill, Drill Poison. So, yep, let's see how is it gonna go, and also guys, in the Tower Troop, in this matchup, I'm playing Cannoneer, so, because this deck is so good with the Cannoneer. So, yeah, we should have a um, really nice time unless he's running Graveyard, which I hope that he's not. So, he got Skeletons and then my, in the Knight, so it should be um, Minor Poison, maybe? He got Barbaro, he got Low Prince, oh no. Oh no, it's gonna be Splash Yard, bro. That's gonna be really bad for us. <laughs> because Splash Yard, Graveyard is a really... It's really, really good if you're running, um, if you're playing Cannoneer, Graveyard is way too good against it. So, yeah, it kind of sucks, but it's fine. So, he's running Mortar, weird. He's running Evil Mortar. So, okay. I guess I'm going to go for my Knight, same lane of his Knight. And then, mm, I guess I'm going to go for my... Huh, interesting. He's, I'm gonna go for my draw and then low prince like this. Because then if he poisons, he cannot defend the draw. So I'll just go Ice Spirit like this as well. Perfect. The baby dragon is dead. And I'm gonna go lock. Oh, really nice lock at that end. I'm gonna go skeletons, then another draw. I'm gonna. I wish I could pop the ability there, but it's fine. 
Oh, really bad knight. We're gonna get a lot of damage out of that drill. Because he's low on elixir, so he cannot afford anything. Yeah, really nice damage. We'll take that. Um. Okay, he might go graveyard here. Yeah, there's graveyard. We'll just poison that. And then evil knight. Uh, yeah, we're pretty much... We should be pretty much okay. The only thing I'm scared of in this matchup is uh, evil mortar. Because once it connects to the tower, it's just basically GG's. So, yeah, I have to be careful a little bit. Uh, okay. Okay, really bad night again at the Zen. I'm gonna go Tesla like this to snipe that little prince out before he pops the ability. And then Ice Spirit. And yeah, we're pretty much okay. The baby dragon is gonna be dead. Poison for the graveyard. Evolution skeletons. And then Drill because his barbell is out of hand. So he has to nado it. He has to nado the skeletons or... Mm, yeah, Lopin is gonna also do the job, but oh, he popped the ability. Uh, okay, we're fine, we're fine. I'm gonna go for my Lopin like this. Poison on defense. Gonna Ice Spirit and then Knight to protect my Lopin. He played Poison, so it doesn't matter. We'll just draw to pressure and then log as well for something. Really nice log though. The drill might get some nice damage. Yeah, the goblins are on the tower, one of the goblins. That's a lot of damage for us. I'm gonna go for my knight. So okay, I'm gonna go Tesla like this. Poison the poison the graveyard. And uh, that was not a good ability it is in there. That's gonna die. The guardian's gonna die, and it's not gonna get any type of value. So we didn't get damage from the drill though, that kinda sucks, but it's fine. We'll just go for my Evo Knight. And then skeletons gonna Tesla off of the baby dragon. I'm not gonna I'm I'm sure that's not gonna connect to the baby dragon, but it's fine. We'll just low prince, ice spirit, poison the graveyard again. And I'm gonna go for my knights. I have to go for my knight, otherwise the goblin and that one barbarian is gonna get a lot of damage. So I'm gonna go drill now because his knight is out of hand. I'm gonna log as well. Poison on defense. Uh, wait, is he gonna pop the ability? That was not the best Barbaro, so he had to waste his knight on defense. So, I guess, oh, he's back to graveyard already. I have to cycle back to another poison. There's a poison. We're gonna lock the knight. I'm gonna go another drill to pressure him. And... Gonna ice spirit like this, just in case if the more evil, <laughs> if the mortar connects to the... Connects to that, so yeah, it doesn't connect to the tower. And yeah, that's gonna be, that's gonna be poison. Yeah, I'll just go like this and then log. Yeah, log is gonna be enough. So, really nice one right there. And I'll see you guys in the next match. Okay, let's go. Game number five and the last matchup. So, anyone who wins this game is gonna win the best of five. So, because we are 2-2, two -two, I won twice, he won twice. So, yeah, and in the deck, guys. I'm running Mind Poison Warbreakers. Yeah, Mind Poison War Evil Warbreakers, Evil Skeletons. And I'm pretty sure that he's running E Giant because E Giant is his main deck. So, yeah, we both of us are playing our main decks right now. So, oh, I'm gonna pop the ability. Oh, weird. I didn't, I didn't got the ability for some reason. But it should be fine. Gonna go Ice Spear like this. And then Warbreakers. So I'll poison that. That's pretty good poison value for us. And yeah, we should be pretty much fine here. So is he gonna pop the ability? Uh okay, he didn't. It's fine. Gonna go for my miner and then skeleton like this. I'm gonna ice spirit as well. Warbreakers at the bridge just to bait out his cannon or maybe NATO. Yeah, he NATO is fine. So okay, okay, okay. Hmm, I'm pretty sure Cannoneer is going to be enough for the defense. So, okay, played the low prince. I'm going to go for my low prince, log, minor. And we should be fine, though. Hmm, he played a little bit aggressive. I'm going to go evil skeleton split. I'm going to pop the ability evil skeleton split. Oh, perfect. He also wasted the barbaro. It's going to go cannon. Uh, not the best ice spirit at my end. That, if that, that ice spirit could have been a lot better but yeah it's fine uh he's up like two two elixir if i don't be wrong yeah he's up like two elixir so we should go e giant at the back 
I'll go for my minor. Yep, there's the E giant. I'm gonna go for my uh case skeletons to cycle. Gonna go ice bread, low prince, same lane of that evil knight. And uh, okay, I'm in a really weird position. I'm gonna go poison skeletons. Good lightning at his end. But cannoneer should be good. Yeah, we should be oh we should be pretty much chilling with the cannoneer here gonna lock wait he's back to another e giant he might go <laughs> bruh okay wait we got the king to activation and oh my god that was such a good nato at his end i have to go another bomb tower mm, yeah we're fine i'm gonna go lock skeletons oh my god cannon is so good against e giant cannon not gonna lie cannon carried me in there so I'll go for my minor ice spirit, low prince, same lane of the knight. So okay, we'll poison. He might go for a lightning. Okay, he decided to go for the low prince. That's also a pretty good play it is in. I'll just log here, ice spirit. I'm gonna cycle another poison. Wow, we already back to another poison. That's crazy. Gonna go wall breakers. He might go cannon. That's exactly what we want to see. We'll just pop the ability here. And then I'm gonna go for my ice spirits, and I'm just. Mm, oh, I guess I'm gonna just log here. I don't want to waste my evil skeleton, so I'm gonna go for my miner. Gonna poison that little prince, wallbreakers. Uh, okay, that bomber is gonna bounce on my tower hopefully once. Okay, perfect. And then we're gonna go ice spirit, evolution skeletons. Gonna miner his tower. Quite aggressive lightning in the zen, so I'm gonna just spam everything. Gonna log as well. Hopefully, we get a wallbreaker connection. Nope, we didn't. Which kind of sucks, but it's fine. So I'll go skeleton like this, poison on top of that little prince, minor wallbreakers. Uh, come on. Okay, we didn't get damage. I'm gonna go for my little prince at the opposite lane to activate true card cycle, and then all I have to do is just minor poison him at this point. Because, yeah, that's the that's all I have to do as Trix Elixir. And he got two e down. I'm going to go Evil Skeletons. Okay. Bruh, Evolution Skeletons, they're not dying. Okay, they died. Like, Lil Prince killed them. Otherwise, they would have stayed alive, I'm pretty sure. And just like that, we won the best of five. And if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like and sub. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.